All right, here we go. Another episode of the obligatory Pokemon YouTube saga, Red Version. So last we checked, we had just caught Flutterby. So we've got them all aligned. And now comes the training section. Two hit KO. one of those grueling processes that, you know, it's just three levels. Somebody will just say it's just three levels. Those three levels can take forever, depending on where you're at. That's why I'm hoping for Kakuna. Knowing my luck, I'll probably run into another Pikachu. No, it's a Weedle. At level 3. So let's take a look stat-wise. So defense is up, speed is up, and special is up, but that attack... About 88 to go. We're gonna switch to our bug killer. Hope we don't get po oh poisoned. Let's head back to healing. I was kind of slightly hoping that we were going to run into a battle right there. This is the grueling grind. I would do this all off camera, but uh, by doing so, I'm pretty much. It would be the same as cheating, really. Because I couldn't show you if whether or not that I'm using like a cheating apparatus or. You know, like a game shark or put codes in or something like that. And there's no real proof of passage of time. So, as much as it's grueling to watch this, and trust me, it's, it's just, <laughs> just about as boring. But we will definitely, definitely. And I just switched to the wrong Pokemon. We will definitely be getting to uh, Brock pretty soon.
Thunder Shark down. Bye bye, Birdie. Stats 39 to level up. So at the at the most three more battles. Ooh, King went up a level. Fantastic. See, as I said, with the max HP, now Hamilton gets a chance to rise up to the top. But, as I said before, I wanted to get all of the Pokémon roughly at about the same level. Now, I'm going to keep on power leveling uh, Flutterby up because... At level 12, Butterfree learns this move called Confusion. That's just specific to Red and Blue. Level 4 Radita. What that's going to do, that confusion, is, is it's going to sweep right through Brock without any issues, hopefully. So, yes, it's a slow start, but once things are in there, there Flutterby's level 8. And Jack is level 9. Double level. And Jack learned a terrible move. That brings Sparks up to the top. They're at the same. Come on. Under 72 to level 9. Okay. Mm. Let's get Hamilton some experience. A level 2 Rattata, I'm pretty sure Flutterby can take that out by himself. He might be able to take a level 3 on. There we go. Another Rattata, level two. K 
Come on, Flutterbug. Fish aren't biting. There we go. Hmm. Let's try it. We'll find out if Gus is a normal type. Because if it's a flying type, it'll be super effective. Come on. It's a normal type move. And this allows Flutterby to gain experience on his own. 23 experience points. I'm gonna risk it. Missed! Come on, Flutterby. One more hit. Thirty-one. I'm gonna heal up real quick. Oh yeah, first step in. And it's a Rattata. It's a level 3. I think Flutterby might be able to take it. Looks like it's a 4 hit. Unless I get lucky. Yeah, I got lucky. It was a 3 hit. 24 experience, let's see where he's at now. 46. So, about between 2 and 3 battles, and he'll be level 9. A level 3? Let's take him out. Voila. 24 experience. Level 3 Pidgey. Live! Thank you. Flutter by grade to level 9. Fantastic. Flutterby evolved into Butterfree, so that's our second evolution.
let's take a look at our Pokemon. So we have Flutterby at 11. Let's see how close he is to level 12. 88 to go. We've got Jack, Hamilton, King, and Sparks. And we've got them all, well, almost in the right spots. So we're putting Hamilton back at the bottom because he's got the most HP other than Flutterby. But we're going to deal with that later. We've almost got him to the point where he's got that confusion. And hopefully we can get that Boulder Badge. But I do want to boost everybody else up just a bit. Because if you remember last time we fought the trainer inside the gym and he wiped out at least two Pokemon. There we go, 32 out of 88. Here's another Pidgey. Okay. Just need 33 more. Oh, stop missing. One more battle. Let's try it. I know it's got sand attack. One more. Ah ha! Level 12. Flutterby grew to level 12 and learned confusion. That's exactly what we're gonna be, what we were looking for. So I'm gonna swap him all the way down. We're gonna get the rest of our team up at least to level 10, maybe 11. Jack will make quick work of this. You know what they say? Hawks tend to go towards, uh, well... I wouldn't call him a hawk, I guess. He's more like a, a sparrow. I mean, that's, that's kind of sort of the... the joke behind Spiro. Is that he's a sparrow. Two birds going at it. I was gonna say, not very effective. Critical hit. Oh, I guess not. Um, that's interesting. Won't be long now. Eighty seven. 
three or four more battles. Type advantage. Jack Grid level ten. That's a bit better. And you know, King is level ten. We're going to go ahead and heal up. Now we only have one potion. I'm not going to worry about Pokeballs right now. Let's see. Only 315. We can buy potions, I'm not exactly sure how expensive they are. I think they're like 100 or 150. 300, so I can only buy one. Let's just see how we do. As per usual, we're going to go ahead and save. Now here's something interesting. He actually gives you tips. Hiya, I can tell you have what it takes to become a Pokemon champ. I'm no trainer, but I can tell you how to win. Let me take it to the top. Yes. Alright, let's get happening. The first Pokemon out in a match is at the top of the Pokemon list. By changing the order of Pokemon, matches could be made easier. Okay. 
Future City, Pokemon Gem, later Brock. Winning trainers, Draco. So technically, our rival has already been here. So let's get this show on the road. I'm Brock. I'm Pewter... I'm Pewter's gym leader. I believe in rock hard defense and determination. That's why my Pokemon are all the rock type. Do you still want to challenge me? Fine then, show me your best. Boss battle. It always looks like he's not wearing a shirt. So he sends out Geodude. Now, I'm pretty sure this isn't going to do anything, but I wanted to try anyway. Defensive curl. Fantastic. So we're going to go ahead and switch Sparks out. Electric doesn't work on rock types. Defense curl. Let's go ahead and confuse this guy. Sparks gains 109, Flutterby gains 109. He's about to use Onyx. I'm not going to switch Pokemon. Level 14. That's going to hurt. Here's the benefit. Onyx is confused. There's a good chance that... Oh, lowered my defense greatly. But Confusion has a chance that... It'll hurt itself in Confusion. And there we go. Ladies and gentlemen, Brock is down. I took you for granted. As proof of your victory, here's the Boulder Badge. I received the Boulder Badge. That's an official Pokemon League badge. Its bearer be bearer's Pokemon become more powerful. The technique Flash can now be used any time. And I gained 1,386. Instead of buying one potion, I could buy two. Yeah. It's more like five. Wait, take this with you. We received TM34. That contains Bide. And you can teach it to a Pokemon that uh, can actually use it. DMs only go good once, so when you teach... Yeah, when you use one to teach a new technique, pick the Pokemon carefully. Your Pokemon will absorb damage in battle, then pay it back a double. Provided that your Pokemon doesn't faint in the time that it takes. So yet again, we're going to go ahead and heal. And we can actually move on to the next area. That's opening up some possibilities. There's also going to be a, a good amount of trainers, which means that we're going to have a good amount of experience points. Now we're still blocked off by a lot of stuff because uh, in order to cut things, um, that's another H, uh, you know, that's another technique that we'll be able to pick up. Um, Flash is one HM or hidden machine. Uh, let's fight the lass. You looked at me, didn't you? But there's flash, fly, cut, surf, and strength. And we're going to have to find every single one of them if we are going to get to the Pokemon League. Open that up with a Thunder Shock. That should be a 1k. Yeah. And she throws out another Pidgey. I'm going to keep uh, Sparks out. Oh, that should have been a one-hit KO. Now I've got to deal with Sand Attack. You better hit it. Good Sparks. It's 105 experience. Sparks went up to level 11. You're mean. Go ahead and sort these Pokemon. That means Hamilton is up first. Let's see what we've got to contend with. Hey, I met you in Viridian Forest, which means this is a bug keeper. Bug catcher. A level 10 Caterpie against a level 10 Hamilton. 
So we use an ember attack. Super effective. There we go. 112 experience points. Gonna pull out a wheel? Nah. Do not poison. Do not poison. Yeah. Ooh, Hamilton grew to level 11. So let's use Caterpie. Let's use Jack. And we're gonna pack that Caterpie to death. Super defective. And voila! Jack gained 112 experience points. And we got 100 for winning that battle. Alright, and then we do the glorious swap. Hi, I like shorts. They're comfy and easy to wear. And his ratata is in the top percentile. Youngster wants to fight. He sent out Rattata. Ah. It's a level 11 Rattata, so surprisingly enough, this is actually going to be a very close battle. Um, I don't have any fighting moves, so I can't just one hit KO it, and I am actually one level under. And if he happens to have Hyper Fang or Super Fang, that's gonna hurt. Alright, King gain 133. He's about to use Ekans. You know, yes, I'm gonna change Pokemon. I'm gonna use Flutterby, and I'm gonna show you why. Ekans the Snake is a poison. Psychic is super effective against poison. And he missed the wrap. Good on ya. Flutterby grew to level 13. All right. I don't believe it. Gained 165. Hmm. We'll hold off going to the uh, Poke Center for now. Are you a trainer? Let's fight. Another bug catcher. No, that Poison Sting isn't going to do a whole lot to King, and that Horn Attack should cause some serious damage. At least over half. And that String Attack, that String Shot did not get him. Ooh, level 11, yeah! The Catcher is about to use Kakuna. I will go ahead and switch, because our next Pokemon on the list is only level 10. So Jack needs to get that experience, and a Kakuna, that's going to give a lot of experience. Now if I remember correctly, there's a good chance that the next Pokemon is going to be a Caterpie, or it could be another Kakuna. But I'm pretty sure it's Weedle, Kakuna, Caterpie, Metapod. Jack gained 136, is about to pull out Caterpie. No, I will not switch Pokemon. So peck that Caterpie down. Okay. Jack gained uh, under two and a level. It's about to use Metapod. I will switch Pokemon because the next one that I should be moving up is Sparks. Use that Thunder Shock. Metapod used Tarzan. There we go. If I had new Pokemon, I would have won. Alright. Let's do the Glorious Swap. And that's still bringing Hamilton up. That's good. Alright. I'm gonna be weird. That look you gave me, it's so intriguing! 
<laughs> Last sent out, Redita. Go, Sparks. Quick attack. Thundershock. Use another quick attack. And a Thundershock. Sparks gains 121, Nidoran. I'm gonna swap, I wanna end this battle quickly. Remember that poison. Hit it. Hit yourself. Yeah, knock yourself out. Mm, be nice. <laughs> That's cute. Hey, you're not wearing shorts. Okay. That's what you got. It's a Spiro. It's a level 14 Spiro. Get that Thundershock. Super effective and paralyzed. Fully paralyzed. That means that I did not get attacked whatsoever. And was able to two hit though. 14 and Sparks grew a level. Oh yeah. Lost, lost, lost! 210 for that. Wait a minute. Maybe. Nope, no hidden item this time. Maybe. So I'm heading back to heal real quick. Pokemon are fighting fit. We hope to see you again. On the road again. Alright, so they've all reset their positions, but all of these Pokemon have all of these Pokemon trainers have all been defeated except for this guy right here, which is gonna catch me. I might as well just do that. You can fight my new Pokemon! Now, I just realized that I forgot to sort my Pokemon. But that'll be fun. Take it out with a Thundershock! Thundershock! One more hit! Thundershock! Alright, Spark Skin's 124, and Metapod, I am going to switch, and I'm going to switch to Jack. Hey, yo, Captain Jack. Alright, we're going to pick that Metapod down. He's going to use Harden. Peck. Oh no! That Harden is pretty effective. Dead. Jack gained 169. Done like dinner. Gained 110 from that bug catcher. So go ahead and swap it on down. Now there are some wild Pokemon here, and then there's this woman. She's got a Jigglypuff. It's either Jigglypuff or Clefairy. Either one. It doesn't even matter, because the problem with these two Pokemon... Now, this is before Fairy was a type. Jigglypuff has a specialty move that is absolutely 100% ridiculous. That's the one, Sing. Now, I'll be lucky if Sing doesn't work. Oh, uh, Leer was disabled. I'm not worried about Leer, just don't take my peck away. No, 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 no. Oh. Fast asleep, pound. This Jigglypuff is ridiculous. Well, one of the problems with... Come on. Wake up. Oh, you're gonna faint. You woke up. Yay. Come on. And you're down. Bye-bye, Jack. 
All right, Hamilton is up. He's going to take the brunt with an ember. And Hamilton grew to level 12. Ooh. That's it? 210 for that. <sighs> that was pretty brutal. He's not a trainer. Ooh. You better take a rest. That tunnel from Cerulean takes a lot out of you. So we're going to get up to here and we're going to heal. But before we do that, I'm going to talk to this guy. Hello there. Have I got a deal just for you? I'll let you have a swell magic card for just 500. What do you say? Yeah, I'm, I'm doing it. Yeah. It's gonna be savage. Bam. And... Let's go ahead and cycle our Pokemon around. That's a level 11, that's a level 12. We'll take that 12, put that 12 into place. And we're gonna bring... Savage to the top. Yes, he's a measly level 5 magic card. Say what you will, but I've got a plan. Alright. Pokemon are fighting fit. We hope to see you again. So let's find out what Pokemon are in this area. I'm pretty sure there's going to be Spearow at a roughly higher level. I want to say average about level 7? 6? 7? Oh, speak of the devil. Level 5. Savage ain't going to do nothing to that. Here we go. Now the worst part about it is, is with uh, Savage, it's going to be level 20 or 22. And the whole entire time, he is going to be literally useless. Now if I had an experienced chair, just pop it on him and I would go about my business. Except for the fact that Pokemon cannot hold items in this version, so instead it would actually affect everybody. It gives the majority of the experience to those that are in the battle, and oh jeez, it's one of those things. Hmm. I want to burn it with fire. Don't sing, don't sing, don't sing, thank you. Oh, you put me to sleep. Okay, you know what? I'm just gonna catch you. There we go. Jigglypuff was caught. Jigglypuff balloon. When its huge eyes light up, it sings a mysteriously soothing melody that lulls its enemies to sleep. That's what I'm going to call it, melatonin. Now I've got to go all the way up to the Poke Center here just so I can heal, but uh, we've got an additional Pokemon, so that's beneficial. Thank you, your Pokemon are fighting fit. We hope to see you again. And this is where I'm going to end the episode. So I'm going to do the save thing. And thank you so much for watching. And keep an eye out for future episodes. This is Trayman, logging off.